your body's response to light. It interacts with a chemical in our bodies called melatonin. And melatonin is a part of our body's response to time um, and, and to light. Melatonin is the brain chemical that gets implicated in things like jet lag and things like that, and certain sleep disorders. And there are some people who will have no mood problems whatsoever except during this period of the year. And particularly if we can trace back a history that this happens every year around this time and it starts around October or November and it lasts until February or March or April and you can establish that pattern of seasonal worsening, that becomes the hallmark of seasonal affective disorder. And if it's mild, usually it becomes self-limiting and it passes on its own. However, for some people it causes more in the way of impairment. It might cause more significant depressive symptoms, including uh, overeating, excess sleeping, decreased energy, depressed mood, suicidal ideation. When those things become more notable, then that's the time to seek, uh, seek help. And I would start with your primary care doctor.